Hey everybody, Ann here, sitting here having my coffee with all you, watching my chickens, watching my puppies. They're so adorable. I know I keep saying that, but it's the truth. And my neck is feeling better. I can stretch all the way over to there and all the way over to there. Keeping my head up has really helped a lot. Um, so during the days that I was kind of like recuperating, I did do some mushroom hunting. Now, I know many of you don't care for my mushroom videos, but I have to document this because I found some really, really cool things. <music> now for some super cute puppy stuff. Well, looks like Junior has finally figured out how to get up on the porch. Porch is loaded down with stuff, so I've got to get this cleaned up. I haven't been able to sit on my porch for the longest time. Well, one puppy I already learned to kind of get down. Let's see if Sonny can do it. Come on, Junior. You can do it, puppies. <coughs> yeah, I put that little thing there just to give him a couple more inches. Hello, Junior. My sweet baby. Come on, Sonny. Sonny's tinier. <coughs> Maybe later. He's probably going to go back in there and take a little nap. Come on, Sonny. You can do it. Come on. Come on, Sonny. Show him how, Junior. Come on, Sonny. You can do it. He's got to learn. He'll do it when I'm not watching. Here he goes. That's right, show him. Good boy, Sonny, you did it! You did it! Go, puppy. Come on, Junior, I know you can do it. Yep. <laughs> Whoops, I think we're going to need some intervention here. Hold on. This. <laughs> he must have got in from the other side. Over here somewhere. Yeah, definitely have got... Oh, yeah, he got in right through there. So I'm going to have to fix that somehow to make sure it doesn't happen again. What are you doing, puppy? Phew, I've been working like a dog all morning. It's about 12.30, and I got a notification. There's something waiting for me at the post office box, so I'm going to go pick it up. Well, I got the box. It's right here, and I'm going to go ahead and open it. Let's see what it is. One more. All right. Okay. Whoa, check this out. Check this out, you guys. Oh, my gosh. Look it. Can you see what those are? I'm going to tell you what they are right now. They are 30 ounce hook on coop cups. How ironic. Ideal for wire cages, crates, chain link fences, blah, blah, blah. Look at this, you guys. There's like one, two, three, four, five, six in them. Six of them in here. I'm gonna open these up. Oh my gosh. We were just talking about this the other day with the situation with the, with the little baby chickens. Look at this. These are beautiful bowls. And you just fit them down in and out, like this. 
and this hooks on to whatever they need to hook on to. I'm gonna go put those in the coop right now, take those plastic ones out because these are much better. They're gonna be easier to fill and take out and clean. This is going to be amazing. Shoot, I could even use these for the puppies. Heck, I could use these to cook in, like um, make a little cake or something. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see if there is a note. Let me see if there is a note. Hold on, gotta put this down in here. Gotta take them all out. Uh, note, note, note. Here is, huh, it, it doesn't say who it's from. Maybe there's another one. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe this. And I was just thinking about this the other day when I put those janky little plastic ones up. There, there's no other note. I have no idea who these are from. Whoever you are, thank you. I am going to implement them in every coop that I can. The van, I'm sure there's something I can hook hook that up into. Um, well, in the in the you know the baby chick area, definitely. It's just gonna hook right on where I put those other ones, and it's gonna make it so much easier. Um, but for the other chickens that are in the van, you know, if I don't get up right away, I'm always up right away. I mean, I'm usually up by 4:35 uh, 5 a.m. Um, I can figure out somewhere to put them and in the other I, I, I have places I can put all of them so I'm gonna go do that right now and here's these two this is hooked onto the door it swings out with it and then the water is over there look at they're standing on it and they're not even tipping it over and it's working great oh these are gonna make things so much easier they're very sturdy oh and they can, they can stand on the ground and, and get to that too. But they love to get up and stand on things and poop on things. <laughs> Look at these crazy chickens. Oh, this is wonderful. See, that's how it's supposed to be done, you guys. They were thirsty. And would you look at that. It goes great on this hardware cloth. I put grit in one and their food in the other and they can drink water out of their black tub that's off to the side there. But this is also very wonderful. It's gonna simplify things for me. And I'm gonna scrub this out and sanitize it and use it for the little puppies. See there, Torch is already inspecting the grit. He's like, ah, I don't know. I don't think I need any grit right now. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, maybe I'll have a little bit of grit. Come on, ladies, you can go in and eat too. And then for the bachelor pad, I just put these out here. Yep, they get grit too. And I just put a little bit in there because they've got food out in the yard. But I'm gonna put it here for now on because they just kick it onto the ground and once they kick it onto the ground, they, didn't, they don't really like to eat it too much. So hopefully this'll help stop some of that. But this is gonna be so much easier. Look at me. I'm hot and sweaty. Yeah, I can't believe it's so hot in October. I don't know how much it is, but it, it feels like it's like 86 degrees. Anyhow, I don't know who you are, but thank you so much for sending these. These are going to last forever. They're going to last a very long time. It's going to simplify my life. So thank you. Thank you so very much. Look at this one. <laughs> a little earlier, I had left some leftover dinner from last night and uh, I put it in the yard. And this one, no, not that one. It, it was actually that one. It was actually Sonny had chewed a hole through this, and he had half of his body through, trying to get through to that food I had put on the ground. It's gone now, but that was just hilarious. Look at these puppies. I can't get more than a couple feet away from them, and they start yelping. Oh, 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 you know that's going to happen. <laughs> Okay, guys, I'm coming in, but you got to move. Come on, Sonny. Don't you dare think about going out there. Oh, yeah, they need to get a little bit bigger before I have to stop worrying about that. Look at them. Are you happy now? Tim Mama is back. Hmm? Are you? Are you okay now? No, no, puppy. No, oh, oh, no, no. All right, I'm going to have to figure something out. I guess I'm just gonna have to block that little space off and probably the whole chicken yard too so the puppies won't chew through it. I'll just have to be mindful when I put food out like leftovers. Oh man, Sonny, oh, he just wanted to get to it so bad. 
Anyway, uh, I did get some more done today. Yeah, I got quite a bit of other things done, and I'll show you those in the next video, because this video is already long enough. Anyway, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.